Everyday Cooking with Anne. Today we're going to be making a fruity slush. This slush works for winter, summer, spring, and fall. It's so delicious and it pairs with almost any meal that you would like to make an impression with. Okay, so today we're going to start this and then I'm going to show you the other ingredients that we're going to put in our slush. But we're making a sugar syrup. So I'm putting three cups of water in our pan to boil. And I'm going to also add two cups of sugar that's going to dissolve in this water. One, two. I'm going to stir this up a little bit here and dissolve it. And meanwhile, I'm going to turn this down just a little bit. We don't necessarily need it boiling, but we want it to totally dissolve the sugar in the water to make a syrup. While that's working, we're going to come over here. Our sugar syrup is dissolving. We're going to show you the ingredients that are going to go in the slush. They're going to have ripe bananas. I have some raspberry lemonade. You can use regular lemonade if you want. The recipe calls for a can of lemonade and two cups of orange juice and two cups of pineapple juice, but we're going to basically double this because we're feeding a crowd. You also want to have either 7-Up or Sprite to add in at the last minute to make the slush. So refreshing. The first thing we're going to do to get started is we're going to take our ripe bananas and we're going to peel those and I'm going to mash those up the best I can here. On this we, I've actually mashed four bananas to go into our mixture and I'm going to go ahead and bring over my dissolved syrup or sugar water. Pretty much that's pretty hot but that's okay. And I'm going to go ahead and add in the banana. Mix that in, and we're going to add in our raspberry lemonade, which will dissolve very quickly into this nice hot sugar water. And the recipe calls for two cups of two cups of orange juice, but we're putting a whole can of orange juice in, which I've done in the past as well. One thing about most recipes, you can modify them to fit what you would like to do. If you have more people, just modify it a little bit. And if you like more orange juice or less, then you can add more. Okay, we've added that, and then I'm gonna add about four cups of this. I'm not sure how much this is, but we're gonna do the, um, you want really good high quality um, pineapple juice, and I found Dole is the best. Four cups of pineapple juice. Now if you want, you can add a package of Kool-Aid or any other um, fruity coloring. It's artificial though. So it's up to you if you want to add that to just make it look more aesthetically like a punch. What we're going to do now, um, because I love all these little bits of banana in here. It's really, really good. So you don't need to puree that or anything. Okay, so we're going to now put our mixture, we're going to let it cool for a little bit, and then we're going to be putting this all in the freezer. And then tomorrow when we, ser when we are serving our dinner or making everything up, we're going to have a beautiful fruity slush. You can make this for breakfast, for a breakfast slush, or you can make it with your dinner as something fruity on the side. We'll be adding our whole thing. of. You can use either Sprite or 7-Up, a 2-liter, and that makes a nice big punch bowl of yummy fruity goodness. Actually, the next day, and for us it is Christmas Day that we're serving this, this is our slush that we're going to have with our Italian panzarotti. And you can see that you can see the bananas are all in there. I'm just this is a little bit slushy down here. I'm going to go ahead and add it into our nice big large punch bowl. It almost kind of looks like a nice ice ring there. And I'm just going to start slushing it around like this a little bit, breaking it up, which will turn it into a really nice slush. Now, if you don't like the color of this, and we just didn't happen to have Kool-Aid on hand to give it a nice pink color. Um, okay, but it's very orangey. It's got the pineapple juice, the raspberry lemonade, orange juice, and the bananas. Okay, and we're going to add some, uh, some um, you can use, use Sprite or 7-Up. And this is really a refreshing like breakfast drink or like we're using it as a dinner drink to go with our Italian meal. That's something very refreshing with our spicy Italian meal. I'm going to put that in there. Just mix it up a little bit more. 
just breaking it up so it'll turn into slush. I'm just using my wire whisk to do this. To break it up a little bit. We got some nice ice chunks in here that'll keep it cold. If you wanted to, you could add fresh raspberries, blackberries, or any other berry fruit to it to make it more colorful. Okay, I've mixed that up a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and add some to our glasses. Okay, yum. Let me see. Mm. Oh, fruity, cold, slushy, and delicious. Give it a try.